According to the Deputy Director of Corporate Planning in the Education Ministry, Alex Sikume, the country is short of 4,000 classrooms. When you look at um, the focus of the ministry, is to provide education to the Namibian child. And what we want is each child should have access to quality education, regardless of where they are. And the challenge that we have is schools in urban areas have proper infrastructure and we still have learners in rural areas, as alluded to by Tim Kanjo, that rural schools, some of them are still in tents, this is the reality, dilapidated structure, this is the reality, and we don't want to, to do that because we are defeating the purpose of uh, providing quality education. MTC, through its Rural School Project, is partnering with the government of Namibia to build quality classrooms for learners, especially those in remote areas. The Omatako Primary School in Tsumkwe will be one of those institutions to benefit from the initiative. This school was started in 1981, um, quite a lot of students and teachers, and they are still being told in um, this old army barracks that were built pre-independence. And... Uh, but not because it's an army barracks, uh, because you can find inspiration in any classroom, but it's because of the dilapidated state of those classrooms. And that's why I've decided, we have decided on Omatako. Um, usually we will take two schools, but this time we are taking one school only because of the great need that Omatako has. For the first time in 40 years, six new classrooms as well as a storeroom will be built at the school. Ocho Don Jupa Governor James Uriqua expressed his gratitude and assured the nation that his constituency is doing its best to ensure positive initiatives are being implemented. Tsumkwe constituency is lagging behind in terms of a socio-economic development trajectory and these such initiatives come in very handy because the employment will be given to those that are on the ground, to those young men and women that are sleeping at home and hoping one day I will be able to get a job. So thank you very much again for that, MTC. The Rural School Project was initiated in 2020 and has since built eight classrooms at the Okonduane Primary School in Opuo and Sizongoro Combined School in Rundu for 1.6 million Namibia dollars.